Hello everyone, how to solve uh, 4 to the power of m square over 16 to the power of m is equal to 64 and uh, uh, now the very first thing we are going to do is uh, here you can focus on the denominator and now first I will take this denominator to the right hand side so that it will become in this form 4 to the power of m square is equal to here it is multiplied by 64 and it will become 16 to the power of m multiplied by 64 and after that uh, now we will write 16 to its prime factor form so we know that 16 is equal to 4 square and its whole power m times of uh, the prime factors of uh, 64 are 4 to the power of 3 and after that we will apply here the famous and well known uh, the power rule or uh, exponent rules uh, so you know that if we have a to the power of m to the power of n so it is equals to a to the power of m times of n and uh, again i will use another exponent law and which is uh, in that form if you have a to the power of m uh, into a to the power of n so it is equals to a to the power of m plus n so now we can apply here these two exponent laws okay so that uh, First, uh, I will apply here this exponent law in this expression uh, so that it will become 4 to the power of m square is equal to now we can multiply these exponents and it will become 4 to the power of 2m multiplied by 4 to the power of 3 and after that we will apply here this exponent law because here bases are same so, so that it, we can just add uh, its exponents and it will become in this form 4 to the power of 2m plus 3 and in the left hand side we have 4 to the power of m square after that we can apply here the exponent law which is in that form if we have a to the power of m is equal to a to the power of n it means that if bases on both of the sides are same so that its exponents are equal to each other now we can apply here this exponent law okay so that uh, these bases are same so its exponents are equal and it will become in that form m square is equal to 2m plus 3 and now we can take all the terms in the right hand side to the left hand side so that so that it will become m square minus 2 m minus 3 is equal to 0 and uh, this uh, uh, nice equation will becomes in quadratic form uh, so that here uh, uh, we can make the factors of this quadratic equation so now uh, we need uh, any two numbers whose product is minus 3 and whose sum is minus 2 okay so that uh, we need numbers whose product is minus 3 and whose sum is minus 2 so that these numbers are minus 3 and plus 1 okay so when we multiply minus 3 by plus 1 so it will become minus 3 and when we will add minus 3 and plus 1 so it will become minus 2 so here we have minus 2m and now we can multiply this expression by my, my, uh, by m so that it will become minus 2m is equal to minus 3m and plus m. So now we can replace this minus 2m by minus 3m plus m and it will become m square minus 3m and plus m minus 3 is equal to 0 now we can uh, take common from these terms and this one so here we take common m and it will become m minus 3 here we take common plus 1 and it will become m minus 3 is equal to 0 and now we can take common m minus 3 from both of the terms 
so that it will become m minus 3 times of m plus 1 is equal to 0 and after that here we have two cases the first case is we will take m minus 3 is equal to 0 and the other case is we can take m plus 1 is equal to 0 and in this case we get here m is equal to 3 and in this case we get m is equal to minus 1 so finally we have m is equal to 3 and minus 1 so this is the our final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos